What's up guys, David Land here bringing you something completely awesome. This is NASCAR 14, my first gameplay at, wait a second. Huh, never mind, this is not NASCAR 14. It may look like it, but this is NASCAR 15. And right off the bat, I would like to start with a few complaints. The car on the front of the box is not actually featured in the game. Huh. And that's not the only car that's not featured in the game that's on the back. Hmm. And I would also like someone to explain to me why Clint Boyer sponsor, 5 Hour Energy, is censored, but this sponsor is not. In, in regards to this uh, whole, like, Let's Play series, we're gonna um, go through the whole uh, NASCAR uh, Sprint Cup, all the tracks, the Sprint Cup series, every single track, but we're only gonna go to them once. So I think it ends up being like a 23 race schedule that way. Um, the chase will remain the same uh, race-wise, um, so we'll go to all 23 tracks on the NASCAR circuit. Yeah, I'm gonna set it up like a season. I will be competing in, as you can see, my sponsored uh, car there, my Ford. Uh, this is the Land Speed Racer. David Land uh, is the driver. That's me. Um, but yeah, so that's how it's going to work. We're going to do 23 races. I'll keep track of the points, and uh, hopefully I'll make the chase. If I don't make the chase, then you'll just get 23 races. And if I make the chase, then um, you will get... Uh, uh, 23 or you'll get 13 races and then a 10 race chase or nine race chase whatever it is um, So that'll be exciting. That'll be fun. Hopefully uh, And it'll keep things interesting um, and another way. I'm gonna keep things interesting is that uh, I've got the difficulty cranked completely high I've got the AI set to the maximum. I've got all the assists off and I'm using a controller I usually use a Logitech G27 racing wheel to uh, to race on uh, but I've decided for the challenge, uh, I'm not going to do that. I'm also not going to use cockpit view. I'm going to use third person. Um, so you'll be able to, to ride along uh, behind me. Uh, I think that's that lends itself better to uh, NASCAR 15 Let's Plays uh, better than, uh, better than uh, you know, the cockpit view, which I would prefer to use because I feel like you get a better feeling. But, uh, yeah, whatever. So the first race we're going to do today... Uh, for the first race of the season is the Daytona 500. Uh, it'll be a 20% uh, 20 race, 40 laps. Uh, I will be qualifying, but you won't, I won't show you the whole thing there. Um, so without any further ado, for, uh, for you people who are just here on your first time, I'm going to give you a little time code to skip right to the gameplay. So right there, if you don't want to listen to me prattle on for a little bit longer, uh, go right to that time code that I'm showing you right now. But if you are a returning subscriber and uh, you're a big fan of the, like, the NASCAR Authentics reviews and all that, stick around for just a couple more minutes. Um, Alright, so this is a new series, obviously. Um, but people don't really know that this you know, uh, video, or this channel, I should say, David Land, that's me, my channel. Um, people don't really know that this is, a game that this is now a gameplay channel where I'm going to be doing... Uh, games like NASCAR 14 and hopefully more or NASCAR 15 uh, NASCAR 15 and you know stuff like that so uh, to kind of take it off uh, I, I would like not only for you guys to uh, to like the video I've got a goal of 120 likes but that's not really that important uh, what's really important is that you guys share this video let people know that I'm doing gameplay and I'm doing NASCAR 15 because from what I looked at I looked at some of the people who do NASCAR 15 videos it looks like they filmed on a potato I, I don't understand I don't understand that so um yeah yeah I don't understand that oh and another thing I don't think I mentioned this begin to begin with but uh, there'll be no swearing in this uh, let's play series um, a few, few people have addressed that concern to me um, about swearing and uh, I can't have a policy if it if it's like a diecast review or it's like something like this I don't um, I don't swear um, I may swear if I like sh upload a short film or something that might have some swearing in it I will always let you know if there's swearing in a video um, so that you know your parents don't get mad at you or you know if you're you whatever your religion is against it whatever I, I understand I'll try to accommodate that but um, yeah, no, no swearing or anything. But yeah, be sure to share the video. Let people know that, you know, 
David Land on YouTube is expanding to video games, uh, and it'll help a lot because I want to get I want to make this a huge series. It'd be a lot of fun, uh, and it looks like it's going to be a lot of fun to do. So uh, for you guys, thanks so much. I appreciate your viewership, and I hope you guys will enjoy this. So uh, let's cue the David Land on YouTube intro, and then I'll show you some highlights from qualifying. So here we are at Daytona, I'm in the garage area, getting ready to head out for my qualifying attempt, uh, or group qualifying here at Daytona. Hopefully I don't get in a big wreck. All right, so here we go. Last lap, I believe, of group qualifying. Uh, we're going to see what I can do. Unfortunately, I've lost my drafting partner. Uh, that's going to make things very difficult. Hopefully these guys in the back here, it looks like Blaney's coming up on the inside. I'm going to let him go. Perhaps, if those guys can get by me. Or if they help me out, I'm not sure. I don't know who's working with him. It might be Josh Wise. Keep but yeah, I'm going to get one more high. lap, so let's see if we can do something here. Oh, I don't want to hit him in the corner. I've, I've learned that lesson. I've done a few test races, and you really don't do want to bump draft in the corner in this game. The spotter is not shutting up. I'm 30th right now. Well, at least I'm qualified for the Indy 500, but that's not really what I want to do. Looks like we're going to get a big old train going here into turn three. Watch him here. He's coming up fast. Let me get up behind Blaney. Oh, no, that's not good. Oh, that's not good. Oh, no. Oh, I got turned by Jeff Burton. Big crash. Oh, that's embarrassing. A crash in group qualifying for the Daytona 500. A lot of rookies. That was me and, and I think Blaney and uh, Burton all ended up in the same spot at the same time. I, I think I made the mistake there. Okay, let's look at the uh, qualifying results here. We've got Austin Dillon, of course, in the three car starting on the pole. Nothing, nothing suspicious there. 19, Carl Edwards. Uh, I know original Big Bry on YouTube is going to be very happy to see that, starting alongside him on the front row. Uh, you can see Ryan Blaney, who I tried to work with there, uh, ended up 8th. Uh, Jeb Burton, who I wrecked with, ended up 20th. And I start 30th. But, of course, I do end up starting ahead of a lot of big names here. Chase Elliott, Danica Patrick, Jimmy Johnson, Kevin. Wow. Well, this is going to be interesting heading into turn 1, I can tell you that. All right, here we go. My strategy, keep it off the wall, stay out of the big one, and uh, hopefully go, keep, hold on to the draft. That's the that's going to be the name of the game to victory in the Daytona 500. Let's go. My rookie race in NASCAR is going to get underway here. The green flag flies, and they're already three wide up go at the by. front, and uh, all the veterans, and Chase Elliott, he might as well be a veteran. Ryan Newman pulling up ahead of me. Oh, this is frightening. Two seconds ahead. In the fourth gear. I am using manual gears. Shifting with the controller. I don't have any help. Well, we're going to have Ricky Stenhouse. The mullet is going to try to help me. Close side. Oh, Jeff Gordon just about. Oh, I got in the wall there. I don't want to do that, David. Behind you. I'm just getting Good absolutely high. eaten up by the veterans Close there. On the bottom. Kenseth Stewart. Are in line with you. Harvick. A who's who of NASCAR. Last They've all passed player. me. Whoa, 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 whoa. Watch what the in the world? Yo, out. Going to I Going don't to think that was my fault. I want to say that wasn't my fault. Let's see. What in the world? Yeah, no, Kenza just wrecked me. Kenza, I tried to go around the outside of Kenza. They all checked up. Maybe I should have been a little less aggressive, but I, I would blame Kenza for that. I'm sorry, Matt Kenza fans, but uh, I, that Wait, was your driver's fault. Clear. Uh, car is damaged. Uh, this is tough. I'm going to pit because I'm in 38th. And usually this game uh, brings some cars into the pits. Unfortunately, fuel strategy. I'm not going to be helped by my um, mistake. Remember what we practiced. Let's do this. Is that Booty Barker who does the voice of the crew chief? Wow, you can already see it with... Not gone off, off to a good start here in the Daytona 500. I was hoping we wouldn't have any yellows, but... Uh, and a nice glitch there. We're out of the pits. Nice All right, here we go. Right there, just like we practiced. Okay, it's time to push that pace now, buddy. Stay focused. We can do this. 43rd. Coming to the green, buddy. Coming to the green. Michael McDowell. You just got to be smooth and calm. 10-4. Up ahead. Oh, this is not going well already. They're three wide. Denny Hamlin making a move to the inside. All right. Let's be calm here. 
Just be calm and try to get through door, this race without any more incidents. We got this, buddy. One outside. Got one of the Dillon boys ahead of me. Unfortunately, they... Oh, 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 oh. Got into Stenhouse there. I didn't mean to do that. Oh, it might, might help if I shifted a gear. Might help if I get into fourth there. Let's go with McDowell here. Looks like he's got a good run. He's going to get around Dil uh, Ty Dillon. No, Austin Dillon. Ty Dillon. And uh, and Denny Hamlin here. Come on, oh. come on, let's get past uh, I don't want to bump draft him in the corners. Stop bump drafting in the corners. The Blanco Deuce is behind me and right Brad behind Keselowski. Uh, unfortunately, we've lost. This little group here has lost the draft already. He's going to tuck in and draft behind you. All right. Now, this is frightening. I, I don't trust these AI yet. On your bumper. To really push me. So it's frightening. It's kind of also really hard with the controller. I don't know what you're doing, Dylan. I do not know what you're doing. Oh, well, they're trying to get to the bottom, and that was almost that was almost a wrap there. All right, let's. Yeah, they're checking up again. I'm gonna go with Danny. I'm gonna give him a shot down the back stretch. Let's see if we can get around Gordon. It looks like perhaps not having a good final Daytona 500, at least in my season. Uh, at least in my outside. series. Series. Whatever. The leader is four seconds uh, in front. Now, see, I didn't trust that. Go to the high side. Ooh, that's not good. Is that Earnhardt there? We're about to overtake right here? No, it's awesome Jimmy. Traffic, Jimmy Great Johnson. Control. Do I want to do this? Oh, that was ill-advised. That was ill-advised. But I pulled it off. Oh, I thought that was for sure a wreck. I don't know what the what's the matter with Hendrick here. Um, okay, they're all go. running in the back let's with go. me. Guys, I'm the one who started all the accidents earlier. Did you not see? Actually, we've got Gibbs, Penske, and Hendrick back here, and Land Speed Racing. No, guys. No, oh, no, no, no. Oh, I don't want to do this. Coming high. Ay, ay, ay. I'm sorry if my driving's ter terrible, by the way. Right, oh, yeah, I, I do want to mention this while I've got a moment in the middle of traffic in the Daytona 500. But, um... Oh, your oh, oh no. I shouldn't have done that. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> this is so embarrassing. <laughs> hey, you can see the roof flaps deploy there and keep me out of the catch fence. I don't know if I have any damage. Hopefully I don't. Okay. So lots of cars use that opportunity to pit. Uh, Kyle Busch now leads the motor race. Uh, looks like I'm now. starting alongside Hold Carl on. Edwards. Hold and uh, to the green. Sorry, Brian. Uh, I might take First him out. I might end up uh, accidentally you taking him out, of course. Nice but uh, here we go. We're restarting 20th. Right to clear. And we've got the, the actual Daytona 500 winner, uh, Joey Logano, coming up there. I know a few Joey Logano fans in the audience who are probably not too thrilled that I'm running around their driver right, as well. Going underneath McDowell. Got to get in the fourth. Got to always remember fourth gear. These gears are so long here at Daytona because it's such a fast right, track, there, and they don't have a lot of power. Of course, a restrictor plate track. That's good. Stay right there for more speed. All right, here we go. Now, do I, do I want to make a pass? Why not? That's worked out so well in the, in the past. Somebody's in the soccer hole there. I'm not sure who that is. I think it's Gilliland. Oh, also... I would just like to point out, David Gilliland, right David you. Land, are both in this race. Man, you're making oh man, from up here. Dale Jr. You're just below. about started the big one there. Just on about started the big one. Oh, that, that's the worst right the there when, they get, when the AI cars get into the back Over of you. Outside. I'm, I don't Car trust it top. at all. Three wide, with with uh, Ty Dillon, uh, Austin Dillon, Ty Dillon, which one is it? Comments, yell at me and tell me which one it is. I can't remember. They don't, for some reason, they don't label. Like, both Bush, like, when it says Bush on the on the ticker there, it doesn't say Kurt Bush or Kyle Bush. So you never know which Kurt, or which Bush, or which Our Dylan Bush you're guy. racing. Far outside, yeah. Thank goodness Robbie Gordon is in this game. You wouldn't know if you're racing Jeff or Robbie. Alright, here we go. We're going to race the Clint side. Boyer car here. Oh, no, 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 no. No, 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 no. Oh Park man, I, that was your door. that was about it right there. I don't want to be the cause of it. I already caused two accidents today. Car outside, trying to get to your corner. Oh no, that I caused it. After that last wreck.
I'm really sorry, guys, and I'm also sorry. Oh, oh no, oh no, I took out Junior. Oh no. So after crashing my way to the front, I have now found myself in fourth position. Uh, I apologize to everyone whose drivers I just took out. Um, Junior Nation wants to. Uh, All right, your door down low. At your door. Wants to to dig a dig a trench for me right now. Good drafting, buddy, right there. And nice. to make matters worse, now I'm going to help Kyle Busch to the front, I think. Wait, do people like Kyle Busch now that he got hurt? No one working the bottom. Is Kurt the one that... Oh, well, of course Kurt's the one that they don't like. You don't need I shouldn't have asked that. But do people actually like Kyle Busch now? One on the bottom. I certainly That's would like it. a NASCAR Authentics of, of that crispy m and stuff. Speedmaster, if, you're, if you've watched this long into this Looking awful inside. driving uh, video... This is this is kind of nice right here. No, it's not. <laughs> We're on the this is this is kind of nice right here because we've kind of we've kind of actually gapped ourselves from the field. Truex, Truex, and I have kind of come through the middle of the pack here. Um, Bush started at the front, and I think Menard did too. Both Bushes, Bush I, Bush, Bushes. Magano's there too. On the outside. Now, I don't know why does my controller vibrate like when I get a really good draft. Is that like supposed Stay to happen? That's what seems to be happening. Clear well, right. Man, I guess just trying to stay concentrated here. This is, uh, right you know, there, I, right? I will mention nice. this now. I, I was going to mention it before I took out Austin Dillon. The first time I took out, out Austin Dillon. Um. But uh, this really actually is, like, if you if you don't have NASCAR 14, pick up this game, I would say. I mean, it's $20. The graphics are fine. Um, it's only 720p resolution, which I found out when I started my HAPOG uh, HD PVR recording of this uh, gameplay. But um, the graphics look fine uh, well, for last-gen console. Um, the sounds are fantastic. I mean, I'm, I'm using headphones right now, so you guys don't pick up um, the sound of the, the game because you're listening to the recording of the game on my computer. You don't need to hear that recording with my voice on it, if that makes any sense. But I'm listening in, in, to it in headphones, and they're not even really good headphones. Outside. But um, Closing up top. the sounds are really, Far really high. good. Oh, and now that Danica Patrick's behind me, I should mention that sometimes the spotter top. refers to her as he. I don't know if he has any information um, that I don't have. The last time Keep I checked, Danica was a was a girl. Outside. Outside. Oh no 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 no! Oh no! I see. That's exactly what I didn't want to be doing. And I really I just I can't you know be. That's not cool. I didn't mean Good to. Man. Nice save. I didn't mean to. Yep, out. I out didn't mean to. Button. I Kyle bushed it though. That was nice. I always kind of get nervous. When I'm three wide and I'm on the bottom with the controller, I just don't feel I have... Boy, Jeff Gordon's not had a very good race either. Um, I just don't feel the confidence. It feels too twitchy. Is there a way to, like, not have the controller be twitchy? Oh, man. I took out everybody's favorite driver. I've taken out everybody's favorite driver in this race. Wow. Wow. Arca brakes. So many Arca brakes. Okay, I'm, I'm using, taking this opportunity to come down into the pit lane. You know, after you had like five accidents at Daytona, you kind of forget things, so I will apologize. But uh, I would just like to point out, I was worried that this, this gameplay was going to be a little bit boring, that I wasn't, that it was just going to be me running around in like 43rd place, and I wasn't going to crash or anything, and there weren't going to be any accidents, and everybody was going to go, David, you're too good of a driver. This is too boring. Yeah, that's not happening. Okay, What's scary to me is that, that I'm worried that the complaints are going to be, David, you're go, a terrible buddy. driver, and we don't like watching you gameplay because on. you crash too much. The leader is four seconds in front. But the way I see it, you can be good or you can good, right be here. bad. All you got to do is be memorable, right? Inside. Oh, this is this is sketchy right All here. Right behind you. Hey. Far in line with you. I remember to get the fourth gear this time. That that's that's a that's a plus. And a big old train up up top here. Some guys are pulling way away there. I don't I think there's one girl up there. Danica did restart second. Yeah. 
Clear left side. I see a green car there. I'm not sure if that. No, that's Menard. No, that was a poor choice. Car up top. Dylan's gonna try to avenge his brother. Oh no. You're good low. The spotter in this game actually is really good, I have to admit. He talks a little too much, behind you. but um, he is quite helpful. So where are we running right now? 17th? Ooh! Four wide in the tri-oval. That, that works at Talladega. That does Our not work at Daytona. Down. Oh, Kyle Here Larson! Kyle Larson is giving me a push! Just keep a good pace. You're doing good. Oh yeah, in my Q&A video, somebody asked me like who my favorite driver is going to be when Jeff Gordon retires. I said Dale Jr., and I'm still kind of sticking to that, but Kyle you. Larson, if he starts winning more, he might be my favorite driver, especially Just because of, you know, everybody made fun of the fact up that up I was really, got really excited about his Spin Master release, but um, right I really do like that target car. I actually really wish they'd make the Energizer car. That's kind of like the top of my wish list right now. That's it, man. Set him up. Yeah, let's do it. Leroy Jenkins. Oh, that gap, oh no! How did how did that not, how was that not a crash? How was that not a crash? How was that not a crash? Okay, let's go. We gotta step it up. I'm shocked. Ten seconds is the gap I have to make up, and I have absolutely. Boy, this this feels like high school, guys. I have got I've got no date to the dance. I am all by myself, and believe me, I don't want to relive high school. Was that a funny joke? I hope it was a funny joke. I hope you laughed at that. And if you didn't, and you kind of like empathized with me by with when I said that, I feel your pain, man. I feel your pain. It's okay. We're all we're all friends here. Who is that? Stenhouse. Well, I was talking about girlfriends, and uh, and Stenhouse actually has a girlfriend in this race. Now, if they have broken up and you're watching this video in 2020, you're not going to get that reference. Halfway but, home, uh, buddy. Me? Come on, Stenhouse, pick up the pace. I know you're a lap down, but come on, we need to get to the front. I'm going to go reunite you with your girlfriend. Come on, Ricky. Come on, mullet. Come on, mullet. Come on. Come on, let's go. Come on. That's my cat voice, by the way. My cat voice is a little higher, but like when I talk to a cat, that's kind of the voice I use. So now I'm talking to Ricky Stenhouse in my cat voice. Woo! your right side. Focus on the road, Land. Focus on the road. Keep a good pace. You're doing okay. great. Okay, I, I made it up to 39th place. Um, I want to start thinking strategy here. I was one of the last cars to pit under the yellow. So I've got fuel on board versus everybody else. Jeb Burton in the um, in that uh, that nicely sponsored car there that uh, that somehow didn't get, get that somehow got past the sensors and I'm not quite sure how. But uh, Jeb Burton, well now Cole Witt leads the race. This is definitely the wild card race. Uh, oh yeah, the other thing about like the chase, like I'm going to actually structure the chase the way it should be. <laughs> So it's not like win and get in. I really do not uh, like that way the chase is set up. So in my series, or my uh, little uh, Let's Play uh, David Land Plays NASCAR 15, as I'm calling it. Guess what? The chase is going to be completely revamped. Brian France, right you're wrong. Get ready to... S s I'm going to show you that the chase can be awesome. And it can be better. And you can improve it. Actually, the best, the best way, the best chase to me is a 36 race uh, schedule. Uh, 36 race chase. You start at the Daytona 500 and you end it in Homestead or Phoenix or uh, whatever track you you choose. But it's a 36 race schedule, and there are uh, 43, at least 43 cars allowed in the chase. And uh, at the very end of the 36 races, the guy who has the most points or girl, let's be fair, the guy or girl who has the most points. Uh, wins the championship. That's my actual, that's my, uh, that's my preferred chase. But uh, since Brian France um, insists on having a playoff system chase, Come on, work uh, your way to the front. I'm going to show you how to do the, the, uh, the chase the right way. So Brian France, if you're watching this Let's Play video from a YouTuber who has like, at the, the making of this video, just over a thousand subscribers, 
and you value his opinion, uh, listen to me. Gotta go get it. Am I breaking too early? Probably breaking too early. Remember pit road speed. And I broke too early. You need some fuel, lad. We're gonna add some tape to the grill. I don't know about track bar and wedge. Somebody tell me what track bar and wedge does. Get ready, ready. Um, Give me a fast stop. Here, you always guys. hear that, like Jamie Little. They'll go down the pit lane. Or no, not really anymore. Jamie Little's just kind of like, yeah, four tires and snow, go fuel. But like back when Jerry Punch and like Jack Root and all them were doing it, it was like, it was like, yeah, we got a half turn of wedge and, and they're adding some air pressure to the tires and you know, like pit reporting actually used to be like reporting. Um, but I'm not really sure You're one lap down. what that stuff does or how it helps or hurts the car. So if you guys want to let me know how to do that, um, so that maybe I can improve my car over a, a run, especially once we get off the play tracks, because the play tracks are really just kind of dependent on the draft, which I've kind of lost. But um, yeah, let me know. All right, Regan Smith, come on, let's go. Oh, Regan Smith, he got away. Um, yeah, yeah, I know I know somebody who's, who's a big Regan Smith fan. Why is Junior Motors, like, why, like, okay, you Technics or Dusen, Dusenberg, Marson, whatever, racing, uh, why why you put Junior Motorsports in as a cup team? Both them and NASCAR Authentics want to make Junior Motorsports a cup team. Like, that would be cool. I, I think Dale Jr. would, is, I mean, he's a great owner in Nationwide, and he's expanded trucks, and, I mean, I would, I, I would hope that someday he would, you know, expand, like, maybe go to Le Mans or something. I know his dad was, was a really, um, that's kind of what he wanted to do when he retired. Uh, Dale Sr. kind of go to Le Mans and, and run GT Corvettes. There was a rumor that he was going to take over, uh, either take over the Corvette racing operation, or he was going to run his own team, um, Dale Sr., that is, um, when he retired from NASCAR, which was only going to be a couple years, um, when he was uh, tragically killed, unfortunately. But uh, maybe Dale Jr. can expand, because he seems like a great owner, of course. Uh, the owner's champion, I believe, in uh, Nationwide last year. Unless Roger Penske got it, which wouldn't surprise me, because he just brings in Brad Keselowski and uh, Joey Logano to, to beat Jeffrey Earnhardt's butt every weekend, which is, you know, kind of cheating, Roger. If I can start working with Smith here, if I can start working with Regan Smith, if I can catch up to him, and we can go to the front. I think the car ahead of him is one of the really Dillons. We've had our run-ins today, me and the Dillon family. Um, I don't know why. In my test races, I crashed with the Dillons a lot, too. I should say that. I have no idea why. All right, so Martin Truex leads the Daytona 500 with 10 laps to go here. And let's uh, let's hook up with these guys. Let's see if we can catch them up. And, uh, oh, yeah, we're definitely catching Dillon here. Nobody's going to make it easy for us today, buddy. Now I gotta work on my drafting. I mean, as a rookie, it's kind of the important thing to kind of get down here at Daytona. We're about a quarter of a lap behind, with ten laps to go now. Moved up, I think, a couple positions. Unfortunately, those two got away. I could wait around for whoever this is, Stenhouse. No, Stenhouse isn't gonna want to draft with me. <laughs> he learned that lesson already, and I put him in the wall. David Reagan leads the motor race right now. He leads the race. That's a full second you made up on the driver in front. Way to go, bud. Three chicken tenders, biscuits and gravy. I throw in a biscuit and a big old cookie. Car in front. Yeah, that car. Actually, I had one of those boxes the other day. I was house-sitting, and I picked up a five-buck box of KFC. It's actually kind of good. Actually kind of tasted good. That finger-licking good sauce, or whatever they call it, was actually decent. Tasted good with the chicken, with the chicken strips I got. The big old cookie was not very big though. Looks like the splash and dash is gonna have to happen now. Looks like I'm gonna have to come in the pits now. David Reagan has taken back the lead of the Daytona 500. The big guns have not featured today, partially due to me causing accidents, but uh, what's going hard? Easy, man. Gotta Easy. make up some time. On pit roads, not what we need right now. All right, we're gonna go with a splash. Okay, boys, be go. safe and smart. Here we go. Coming in for a splash of fuel. I am getting lapped right now, I do believe. That was the leaders coming by. You could see them right now, there. The and out the we go. Awesome that was guys. a splash awesome of fuel. It great, almost buddy. filled the tank. You're a lap down. We've been here before, buddy. Come on, let's pick it up. I think I might just do splash and goes from now on. Well, that's illegal, but I'm going to do it anyway. I didn't mean to. I did kind of push up the track a little bit. 
Alright, if I can hook up with Logano and Bush here. The final lap. Well. <laughs> Never give up, folks. I can still win this thing. To get to your corner. Oh no. Oh no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. No, no, no. <laughs> that was almost disaster to finish the Daytona 500. I at least want to finish the race. Keep it low. Keep it low. Oh, man. Well, it looks like I'm going to finish a lap down, unfortunately, in. Unless we get, unless something incredible outside. happens here. Martin Truex Jr. wins the Daytona 500 and will take an early commanding points lead. We're not sure who is uh, coming in there uh, next. Looks like Boyer is up there. Oh, can we get to Boyer? Come on, Logano. Logano is the fastest car in the entire race. So let's hook up with Logano and see if we can't catch Boyer. It's double or nothing time right now. Gonna push him. This is the best push I've had all day. But it's gonna come up well short. 37th place. 36th place, excuse me. Let's check out the results here. The full results. Um, I did beat Josh Wise, Regan Smith, Ty Dillon, Ricky Stenhouse. And, oh no. <laughs> oh no. The two DNFs are Dale Earnhardt Jr. and Brad Keselowski. Oh no, both caused by me in the big wreck uh, on lap 9. Wow. So let's check out the full running order here. The winner was Martin Truex Jr. by just about, let's see, four, I have four seconds beating David Reagan by Austin Dillon comes home third. Matt Kenseth fourth from an early accident. Not entirely my fault. Of course it was my fault. Casey Kane, Trevor Bain, Kyle Larson, Carl Edwards, Casey Mears, and Greg Biffle. Those are your top ten in points. Ugh. Well, hopefully things will go better in the next race, which I can't remember where it is. Um, I think Las Vegas. So we guys will see you in Vegas. Um, hopefully um, I will have better luck and I won't roll the dice so much in Vegas. So... Thank you guys so much for watching. Be sure to leave a like on the video and uh, share the video. Um, this is a new uh, Let's Play series, so if you guys enjoy it, uh, please do share the video. And let me know what you liked. If you enjoyed a specific moment, put it up there. Put up whatever moment you like the best, and, uh, and uh, hopefully we'll see you in Vegas. Hopefully I will have better luck, and uh, because I'm not a very good blackjack player. I got a race. We will see you next time.